Hey guys, today I will look at uh, how to solder, a uh, very very quick uh, tip on how to solder. Um, I will solder a bullet connector, uh, this one, here. Uh, but the first step, um, doesn't really matter what you're soldering, um, where you have to pre um your wire. As you can see here, some of the wires may come pre um from the factory, I still like to do it. Um, and because of the camera, this is not the most easiest way of doing it. But what you actually do is you put your um, uh, solder iron uh, under the wire and let it heat up. And put your uh, soldering tin on top. And when it is actually heating up, this will melt through the wire and uh, pre tin the wire pretty good. So, for the background noise of the rain, but it's just raining cats and dogs tonight, so um, no flying. So. That's the reason why. Um, but when the wire is heated, you can actually just put your tin onto the wire. And it will melt through and therefore pre-tin um, your wire. It just makes for a better connection. So, after you pre tint your wire, that's the easy part, you take whatever connector you prefer uh, soldering. Um, I've taken one of the easy ones today, which is a bullet connector. I'm using this multi-tools of when I'm holding the different ones. Um, but, you know, I also have a little board of wood where I have different holes in it where these fit in. But for the... Sake of God, I can't find that board today, um, so maybe I should clean my shed a little, but, um, you know. But, this is actually one of the most easiest things uh, to solder. What you do is that you take your soldering iron, um, sorry, and just heat up your bullet connector. Um... I always just put the tin in because then I can see when it gets hot enough. And you have to fill, uh, it's like a cup, and you have to fill it like about half. Um, there you go. And then just keep your uh, iron on it. Uh, you will see the tin um, starting to boil almost. Um, and in this case, just gonna put it on for for some reason you know um, this is fake because uh, only this little piece of wire but what we normally would do you would put the um, what you call it this uh, the string tube uh, onto the wire first um, like this remember that um, but then you simply just dip it into the cup as you can actually see, I put a little too much on here. So there you go. And just hold it for a little while. And then you're basically done uh, with your soldering iron. Um, if this was uh, um, a wire going from your motor or ESC, uh, if you don't have a plastic protected shield, I kind of avoid them uh, sometimes, uh, at least on smaller helicopters, because of the weight. I just use the swing tube. What you do is you just move it over, and just you know, just so it covers it. Um, I just chose the yellow one here because it's a little more easy to see. Um, and then uh, simply heat it up uh, and make it shrink. And uh, I'll do that. And then do the same one, uh, one with the female bullet connector, and you're pretty much done. If you liked, uh, enjoyed this little video, please say so. And if you prefer me to show another kind of uh, connector, um, deans, uh, whatever, just say so, and I will make a little video of that. But uh, this is simply how to very quickly uh, solder a bullet connector. Have a nice day.